Hello friends, welcome to C Sharp Intermediate to Advanced tutorial. Here you are watching the final part of the video. C hash split container. In this video, we are going to see how to collapse a particular panel which is inside the split container. Once user places a check mark here, we will collapse this panel one. So you can use this same technique to collapse panel 2 as well. So if you remember we haven't changed the checkbox. So we are accepting the same name check 1. I mean checkbox 1. Event is checked changed. So when this checkbox is in a checked state true then if you see here the property we are accessing from the split container is panel 1 collapsed so it accepts a boolean property and we are setting true to this panel 1 collapsed so if this checkbox is not checked then we are setting it with the false so when this property is set to true the panel will panel 1 will get collapsed that means it will be hidden and when we set it false the panel one will be visible so this is the way user will make this panel visible i mean show or hide now let's go to the demo here here we are accessing the property for close action panel and we are handling checked changed now let us uh, test this so this is the action panel right so once I place check mark, you can see that action panel is collapsed. Right now I am collapsing it. So if you see here how user is using it, uh, once they added the required item, they closed that action panel and if you see here they are removing certain item and after that they are closing that panel and they are seeing only the uh, list box so this is how you can use uh, the collapsing of your particular panel inside the uh, split container so this uh, concludes our uh, sub series Thank you for watching. Bye.